Hi guys, Trevor Swenson back with Through the Darkness. My personal journey and battle with PTSD. Today I wanted to talk about a topic that continues to come up in my continued therapy. And I also wanted to give you a little bit of an encouragement as far as taking care of yourself mentally and physically. My therapist has been very, very clear to with me that continued methodical, structured, psychological, mental care is very, very important when it comes to battling and overcoming PTSD. I will tell you that my doctor, my primary doctor that I see for PTSD told me the other day that as a patient with PTSD, one of the things that he is, is some of the things I will tell you that he is very, very pleased with that I want to pass on to you because I want you to beat this trauma thing badly. In fact, if it's just one person that because of this channel overcomes the ravages of PTSD and trauma and goes on to touch other people's lives, it would be worth it. But some of the things that he called out that he appreciated so much were my structured and methodical approach towards medication, my structure, structured and methodical approach towards doing things that are healthy and therapeutic and tied more specifically to being therapeutic with PTSD. The fact that I want nothing more than to help other people through my pain and my suffering was one of the things that he listed as well. And I've talked very openly about challenging you to pour into other people because it is healing to your soul when that happens. There is, there is a physical reaction to helping others and loving on others. I just wanted to pass those things on. And the other one, the last one, is I've made a commitment to stay as physically active as possible. And that means just like today, going for a four mile walk through the, it actually it's just a wander through the woods with Murphy. I know is good for my heart. I know it's good for my soul. I know it's good therapy because of all of the uh, studies that have been tied to being out in nature and experiencing nature and feeling nature when you struggle with PTSD. So I wanted to also tell you that and encourage you to do that as well. But what I wanted to talk about today more than anything is what are you filling your head with? As you walk through PTSD, what are you filling your head with? What, what is, and purposefully, what is running through your, what is being put in your head that is starting to retrain your mind in a positive fashion? My therapist asks me all the time, what are you doing actively that, that we know is therapeutic in battling PTSD? What are you listening to? And that's what I want to talk about today is what are you filling your mind with? Now on this channel, I have not been shy about sharing my personal faith in, in Jesus Christ. And one of the most powerful things that I do that turns around my attitude, that turns around my physiological feeling that touches me to the very, very innermost being of my soul is putting in a set of earbuds and listening to the songs that I have listed on our channel. And I challenge you to do that. And the reason I do it with earbuds is that it is a lot different than getting the AM radio sound effect, just listening on a phone without earbuds and listening to earbuds to be able to hear the baseline to be able to hear 
the drum set to be able to hear the keyboards to be able to hear the lead guitar and the rhythm guitar and filling your mind with the promises of the word of god over and over and over and over again and i can tell you for an absolute fact that i'm in my in my own personal journey with ptsd that when i wake up in the middle of the night and i have a a a hook or a line from a praise and worship song repeatedly going through my head i am in a significantly better place than if i have a line from a Nickelback song and I love Nickelback but I will tell you that that's not how I'm going to heal I'm going to heal through the grace and through the healing power of God that is that is how I am going to be healed and that is what is going to heal me and that is what is going to provide the grace to get through this and so I want to challenge you today to ask yourself the question, what are you filling your mind with? And give it a try. I keep on putting songs onto our channel that really have moved me. Put in a set of earbuds and crank it up and listen to the words of promise. Listen to the biblical words that are, are the infallible word of God. And fill your mind with that and find yourself singing those songs to yourself or out loud or on a walk or whatever it is repeating that over and over and over again because it's the truth it is powerful it's alive and it's active and i will tell you i can i can speak from my own experience that the closest thing i can get to supernatural in this world is when I am completely engulfed in pure worship of the God that created me, who sent his son to die on the cross for me, Trevor Swenson, and all of the jacked up things and mistakes that I have made in my life. When I fall into that rhythm of accepting his grace and accepting his promises it is healing and it is so healing to the soul and it's even more healing it's like exponentially healing when you experience it in this type of a wonderful creation and it's okay if you do it in backed up traffic and rush hour traffic but it's not the same get out and enjoy and celebrate the fact that you're there to experience another day, one day closer to your healing and overcoming PTSD and trauma and stressor related disorder. Heal healthy. Ask yourself, what am I filling my mind with? And is it healing or is it moving me in the opposite direction? This is Trevor Swenson. Take a look at the playlist that I've that I've put together. Some of my absolute favorites. Remember, use earbuds because it stimulates both the left and right side of your brain. Play air drums, play air bass, play air guitar. Get that bilateral stimulation going. I wish you the absolute best. Click subscribe. We'll talk to you soon.